Okay, so we are back doing this. We can do a little bit of the main game. But as we're going towards this, we're going to see if there's any crimes. How come won't let me just go directly there? He's gonna be a problem. I'm gonna overheat him.
stuff down here. Did I already get everybody? Well, that was way too fast. way I killed him, right? There's no way I did all that. Okay, extract your dollars, advanced data money, extract your dollars and quick hat crafting components. It's... Ooh. So I need 1C, 1C. So 1C, 1C, then 5. And I did all of them. Nice. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. We're dropping like flies. <clears throat> oh, God damn it. I love this. It's it's like a handicap for me. This arm, it is not mine. None of this me. Cold Are you dead uh... metal? Are you okay? Don't you take a vow against chip and implants? Of course we do. You think I did this to myself? I apologize I cannot bow in greeting. I am still adjusting to my situation. Hold on. Somebody forced you? Not just me. My brother too. They drugged us. Desecrated my body. And all the while, they mocked me. How can you do this to a fellow human being and still mock them? Makes no sense. Who'd go and do something like this and why? We were out begging for alms when, when they approached us. They laughed at us and asked if we would take implants as a donation. They looked more machine than human. They told us they would improve us like tools. Maelstrom. How about your brother? He's still with them? Yes. I was first. Then they were trying to decide how... how to modify him. You look like someone who can reason with these people. I beg you, please, help my brother. I only hope it is not too late. I do not wish for him to end up like... like I have. Chrome-sucking psychos. It won't be easy. Maelstrom never goes down the easy route. The fucking clowns. Help us, please. But without any bloodshed, I beg you. I'll without see what I can do. Bloodshed? Either way, your brother's getting out. I do not know how to thank you. They're keeping him in a shop just north of here. You shall find it next to the road along the docks.
to be some. Chubbs, Chubbs, listen. What if instead of. What now, bitch? I guess that worked. So this is where they're keeping our fellow brother. I wish I'd done on hostile, but I didn't have the weapon. So messages. Ooh. Okay, that's cool, I guess. Do not do this! Invitations against my police. Please! I do not want them! Hello. Calm down. It's over now. I'm not with them. So... What are you doing here? What happened? Glad I got here in time. Are you okay? Did they do anything to you? I was lucky. They could not decide which implant would be... funnier. Cyber psychos. A lot of them. One, one of them wanted to remove my jaw. The thought itself gave me shivers. Thankfully, did not get the chance. To what do I owe this intervention of yours? Was walking by and caught some lame jokes about metal monks. Think about Maelstrom. They're never just joking. Not with the truths that your brother sent me. He didn't want the same thing to happen to you. Thank you for coming to my rescue. But my life is not worth the death of others. One good deed does not justify the suffering you have sown. You have committed evil in its purest form. I liked your brother more. Hmm? What was I supposed to do? Read him a sermon? Maelstrom shoots first, then asks questions. You always have a choice, including not to act at all. That is the most difficult of the paths. I would prefer to lose the only body that I have than to live with the thought that somebody died on my account. Damn, Leave dude. me. I must catch my breath before I go to my brother. It is him who needs saving now. Well, fuck you too, then. Hey there, doll face. Interest you in a preem BD? What do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers, no washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Auteur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch, it's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? Bespoke? Damn, that sounds promising. I get it, I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. 
Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green deal. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, doll. Welcome to Lizzie's. So can I pick you? Can I pick you? Doctor already. Yeah, no surprise there. What? Let's set the car and ask for oh, Avalon. Oh, the pants. Hey. Get you something. So. Curious. The name Lizzie's. That the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Oh, now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Girls were paid right, insured, and had decent security. Good spot, all in all. Let me guess. It didn't last. No. Tiger Claws took care of that. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad ones. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. The gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big Boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up, out of respect. And biz booms to this day. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh-huh. So, Evelyn. Club's big. Gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Sense on. Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Mind if we talk about the job? Heard you got something for me. Mm. But not here. Come with me. I'll follow you anywhere, lady. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. So, what can a Nothing horny sure. girl like really? me do for a hungry guy like truth. you? I a just told vanilla you. Vanilla and sprinkles? Okay. Maybe electrosex. Yeah, yeah, I'll see ya. V? I'm exploring. Jeez. All right, Mom. Oh, oh, that I press a flick to death. Would you like anything else? I, uh... Hey, it's a bit... we weren't finished. Relax. I'm not started yet. Damn, I wish I had that problem. Uh, no, I, wait. <laughs> no, I take that back. <laughs> I'm waiting. Ooh, I'm coming. Yeah, you're gonna hear that a couple times. There we go. I'm gonna get something to drink while this goes. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional. Effective and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. I'm waiting. I'm the best. I'm good at what I do. Got a solid crew at my back, too. Never once botched a job. 
You do realize I expect more of you than scraping street corner data terms. Much, much more. I'm the best, and I know what I'm getting into. Dex was clear. The job's high risk. By the way, you work together long? You and Dex? You write in Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you for this job. Hmm. Curious. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? You know, just never rolled through that neighborhood. Damn shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must have made a deal with the devil. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What, so Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Top dog like you Nobu's been to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay. What's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, all right. Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Right. Jacking off to in those boxes? Mm -hmm. No. They can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. You mean to see you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? It's supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape means you were inside. You, uh, know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. 
suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Hey, there you are. This is V. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna make me barf. Impressive looking setup. Need all this to process brain dances? Mm-hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <clears throat> Judy. All right, all right. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside? Let her look, let her rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Look, I'm no beady virgin, but the raw stuff, uncharted territory. Relax, I'll explain everything. It's less complicated than it sounds. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Create your sensory profile first. Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still, look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Get a lot of requests like this? All the time. But it's usually stuff the girls scroll at the club. I take that and do some routine porn tuning. Crank up the orgasms? More like cut out all the other shit. Fucking's business as usual for these guys. Their minds wander to grocery lists, spouses' birthdays, late bills, whatever. But even then, you can refigure things, mold the emotions into something unique, unforgettable. So, I can't complain. One more sec, need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay, all set. I need to test your profile first, tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see, where could we... Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in and... Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. OK, 
Okay, on you go. Down, everybody! On the ground! I wanna see you kissing the flooring! Muddy! Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. A flash of... intense shock. I can still feel it. I remember. Fuck. That last second. Could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Full cam control and analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback, can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out, and we sell the PD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Yeah, Roll it back I... to the top. All good. Neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creep. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the get out, and we sell the back cool freaks from studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full set. The spot is extra for a wicked adrenaline height. Okay, you go. Okay, right here. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. On you ah, go. Little shitheads. Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? Hey? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like it was happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. 
Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gong at the counter. Down, Ellie! On the ground! You wanna see you kissing the flooring? Money! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Now, or I will fucking drop you! I swear to God! Whoa, yeah, hey, no! Fuck, what? See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. His own chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Yeah, it's impressive, right? Too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? I don't know. I... Ugh, let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... <sighs> yeah. Think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Go ahead. Just need T-Buck to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Runner for my crew. Security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional. Discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Cause you say so? Please, Judy. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. <clears throat> hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Konpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Konpeki? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? <sighs> Unimportant, Bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request... now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire up, Judy. Yeah, whenever this is over, I'm gonna end the RV, video. Eyes open. Gotta find out where Yurino who's keeping the relic. You look like a cut of fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn. She. I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to listen in on that conversation. V could be something important. Finish here in a drone, ventilation and cooling servers. Gotta be fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. We shall see soon enough. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. 
He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. We'll listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must Notice. provide them. Enough. Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. You can't fuck on me. Got five out of a ninety six per cent robot. Wow. That is just wow. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. <laughs> what let me scan this? There it goes. Alarm firmware's fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Anything else for now? For this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. All right. Let's see if I can notice anything over here. Limit signal range. No. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the reason. My father's a tired. Don't see anything. Vision this old gray beard who thinks nothing will change. And he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. We'll listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we will not require specific storage conditions. You must not provide them. Enough. Sorry to make you wait. Business can be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense, edgy. A moment. It will pass. <sighs> Get to work on that. We're looking for like cameras and other stuff as well. Just one condition 
You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus on me. Oh, got any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun. All right, what do we got up here? Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Last time. Uh, that bedroom. Some mission nice. did worse. I'm guessing that's all I've got an idea. Be right back. So that's obviously not it. Oh, I was in. I was in the wrong Manual one. Manual details why. a special Every tip controlled container. Every time. Relic okay. needs to be kept real cool. So chips gotta stay in the freezer. Yep. Could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Yes, fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. Matches the spec in the docks. You are nobody's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We've got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Get everything you need? 
Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Relax. I got it all under control. If you fuck up and they come knocking on my door... Judy, relax. That's not gonna happen. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Let's walk. Well, what do you think? So, what now? V, do this job for me. I mean, me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else, no middlemen. No decks. You want to fuck over our fixer? I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. And a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows and actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. Mistake like that'll cost you your rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. You sure, sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? Your choice. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay, for sure. I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I already have I'll enough be finished. to buy whatever I want. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. That's not an elevator. How things looking, Miss V? Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. I didn't mean to Beautiful. T-Bug already right, called. Be... Said she's working oh, her magic. And night. the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance at that ship without that buy. To work then, Miss V. I'm mean, like, 
that's uh, it was okay. NCPD! Neutralizing <coughs> the suspect! Moving in! Cyberpunk, and I'm gonna start editing my videos a little bit better. Uh, if they get rid of the boring parts, you know, me walking around and stuff, just see the this? intro, the outro. Oh, like that. Oh, I have two stars on me, that's not good. Job complete. That's all you gotta do to hide from the cops. No way, is there a uh, psycho right here? No? No, just something happened, okay. Something ain't right. Um, let me go! Okay, I back off, I back off, damn. Yep, thank y'all for watching. I'm the Mystical Knight. Alright, alright. If y'all want me to play a certain way, a certain game, just let me know. I'll try to get it. Screw you too! Damn, I'm trying to do an outro over here in Asia. Meow!